for Lackey. This is the first tutorial video for Lackey CCG. In this tutorial, I'll give you an overview of what Lackey CCG is, as well as the basics of the interface. Lackey CCG is a program that was initially designed to let a person play any collectible card game, or CCG. Now, people use it to play other kinds of games beyond collectible card games, such as board games, miniature games, and pretty much any game you can play on a tabletop. People use Lackey also to manage their personal collection of cards and to create new plugins for their own original games, which they can then easily share with other people around the world. To play a particular game, first someone needs to create a plugin for that game. Once you've loaded a plugin for your game, you can make a deck, join the game matching server, and host or join a game. Lackey simulates a real tabletop. It doesn't force you to adhere to a game's rules. Just like with a physical deck, you can draw a card anytime you want, and it's up to the players to play how they want to play. There are many different game plugins for Lackey. Just as one game may look very different from another, so too may one game look very different from another in Lackey. Throughout these tutorial videos, I'll be showing you an example plugin, which may or may not do things the same way another plugin does things, but I'm going to show you the basics and I think the information here is applicable to most plugins. There are five panels of the Lackey interface, and you can switch between them by clicking the corresponding tab at the top of the window. There's the Game tab, where you'll be playing your game. You'll see the table here, the hand here, the stats. I'll get into more detail about that later. There's the Deck Editor, where you make your deck. There's the server, where you connect to other players to play games. There's the Plugin tab that allows you to install or update a plugin or switch between plugins. And then there's the Preference that allows you to set your player profile, set macros, change the skin, your sound preferences, and so on. The iPad version of the Lackey interface has an additional section at the bottom that allows you to change the way the touch input is interpreted. Info allows you to have like a passive mouse over. Left click makes the touch act like a uh, left click. The right click mode makes it the touch act like a right click. The middle click makes it act like a middle click. And there's an escape button also as like a, an escape key, which helps you exit out of most menus. In the other tutorial videos, I'll show you how to install Aki and then install and update plugins. And then I'll show you how to make a deck, and then I'll show you how to connect to the server and host games, and then I'll show you how to play a game. 